people like the Excel because it's, uh, it's got a very comfortable cabin, it's got a good uh, payload to range capability, it, uh, it's a reasonably economical airplane to operate. Short field performance is, is excellent in the airplane. You can get in and out of a lot more airports because of that straight wing. And it's just a good all around workhorse for the Citation world. It's an easy decision for owner operators to make the upgrade to the G5000 over the existing avionics package. You're taking old antiquated avionics and upgrading them with uh, the current generation of equipment and it'll extend the life of that airplane for another 20 years at least. It got me excited the first time I saw it. We've got four XLS owners and all four XLS owners did commit to make the upgrade. And obviously from our perspective as a management company, it was more beneficial to us to have each aircraft, each platform be consistent, certainly from a crewing standpoint as well as a maintenance standpoint. Every crew member that we've had uh, get onto the platform, whether they've been here for a while or, or they've come on board recently, they've been thoroughly impressed with the performance of the, the, the systems themselves, as well as just how much more efficient it is to set the airplane up for each mission and how they're able to operate it through, through each leg. It provides the crews, at the end of the day, the safety that is truly paramount in the operations that we provide to these owners. Behind me, you're gonna see a level D simulator, which is the Citation Excel G5000. It's part of the flight safety Textron Aviation Training Company's uh, simulators. Everybody's very thankful that, that they have the option to be able to come train in it that has the G5000 in their aircraft. You know, the most important thing about a simulator is you can use every function of the G5000 in a simulator. In the simulator, especially a legacy, uh, now we can show the clientele who are coming off an older flight management system uh, to this new, really uh, sophisticated piece of equipment, how to operate it and how to use every function on it. Part of the big justification of uh, the G5000 was the uh, new ability to also have LPV approaches. Our current equipment was basically uh, GPS approaches or RNAV approaches and uh, ILS localizer approaches. Uh, we consistently were going in and out of one of our airport bases that did not have ILS uh, or VOR approach per se other than a circling approach. Suddenly with LPV we had uh, the ability to get in where in earlier instances we would have probably gone on to one of our alternate airports. So it was a big selling point. Financial advantages were um, really not that difficult to sell simply because we had such old equipment. We were having higher maintenance costs for uh, the uh, CRT tubes. We were having a stated obsolescence for part of the equipment. We also had the regulatory issues with um, ADSB coming in at that same time. So doing a total replacement uh, really it turned out to be a relatively small delta versus the fact we were going to have to upgrade equipment anyway. It was an easy sell, in my opinion. Anytime you've got a very capable airplane that is in the process of needing enhancements, we go through each option to not only provide our recommendations, but to show what the different options might provide back to the owner. You know, I, I think the G5000 should be viewed at, for the XL and XLS, as an investment into the airplane. I, I think it gives you all your current and future navigational needs, all your enhanced situational awareness that a pilot needs, but it also, it, the, the value that you put into the airplane is a value that you probably see on the back end as well. With VREF and Blue Book seeing that and adding that in as, as an addition to the airplane, it's really, it's really a perfect combination of airplane and technology. There really isn't a disadvantage to doing it. I see no reason why an owner of an XL XLS would not want to make the investment. They'll recoup all those expenses over time, have a better resale value in their airplane when they go to sell it, and have much greater safety and operational use while they own the airplane. Quite honestly, you're getting left in the dark if you don't do this upgrade on an aircraft that it's offered on.